Assalamu alaikum everyone in today's talk we are going to discuss how to insert tables into the IEEE paper in LaTeX IEEE papers are written into two columns and uh, so table may be ins inserted into the uh, double column for example this image this figure is inserted or it may be inserted into the single column as you can see that this figure is inserted into the whole page into the one column so let's start how to insert columns into the IEEE paper so to insert tables I will begin the table format I will begin the table environment here I will initiate the table environment and same I have to end the table environment okay and to create uh, different columns into the table we will create the uh, we will initiate the tabular format okay t tabular tabular will help to uh, initiate different types of columns and the same we will add it here the tabular okay in the front of tabular initialization you have to mention how many columns you are going to insert so in my case i am going to insert four columns so i am going to insert four so i will write c c c c where the c means that the column will be centered aligned so how to create table uh, how to create rows and columns into the table for example, I am going to create such like table where I will define the samples which I am using in my paper. So my first column will be the sample and the second column will be definition. Okay, And to separate the columns, we will put the end sample and here I will write the definition. Okay. And uh, I will uh, define it same because I want to create the table of four columns. So I'm going to uh, run to create two others column. I'm going simply uh, going to simply copy it. Control V. And to end the column, we will put the forward slash. We will put the backward slash. Okay. No. Now let's start to run it to check its results. Let's check the results. Yes, the table is inserted. Now we are going to put the other values to put other value. We will create the same. Uh, we will create the same columns. Okay. To create the same column, I will add the first column, second, and to create the second column, third, and to create the second, uh, third column, and to add the first row. Okay, and uh, after that, I will copy the same. Uh, depends on how many rows I am going to create. Okay, this is three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9 and 10 for example i'm going to create 10 okay and now to define it um, for example i'm going to insert some uh, uh, special symbols here okay for example i'm going to create uh, okay I'm randomly inserting any special symbols to show how the table will work. These are the special symbols which you will use to write any paper. In in papers 
we use different samples instead of writing the detailed okay in the first column i insert a different type of okay here i will define it for example i paste the same definition everyone because we are just learning how to create it okay let's execute it actually this is the execution button and this is the build button and uh, basically i have not installed the pdf into my system so i first build it and after that i open the file you will <coughs> now let's check the result yes here you can see that the table has been created i have in, in here i have inserted different type of tables and here i have defined these tables okay now let's discuss how to uh, insert the line for the column and how to insert the line for the uh, table uh, other rows etc okay If I want to show the columns line, then I will insert the this symbol here. Okay. After inserting this symbol, line will be drawn between the different columns. Okay. Let's check it. <coughs> Let's check the results. And now you can see that. And the column line has been has been inserted. Now we want to insert the uh, top ruler, and here I will insert the mid ruler, and uh, here at the end I will insert the end ruler. Okay, it starts, and uh, simply I will go to the here. I want to insert the top rule, and to insert the top rule. top rule okay here i will insert the mid rule okay this will be little bit bold and uh, here i will insert the end rule sorry this will be bottom Button rule. Okay, let's check it. I sorry, I made mistake. I will write the top rule here because and this is the first row, and uh, I will write the mid rule here because I want to make the first row little bit dominant. Okay, so let's run it again. Let's check the results. Yes, this one. You can see that the top ruler, mid ruler, and the end ruler has been inserted. You may also insert the line after every row. We have forgotten and the last one, the last column. So I will also insert the boundary of the row, last column. Okay. now to insert the caption i will use the caption format i as we used it into the uh, figure okay simply i will write the caption and in the caption i will read i will write the uh, symbol description symbol description
I will also show this table into the center. So I am going to align into the center. Okay, and uh, I may also use the label. Uh, label will be used at the end of uh, uh, to create uh, different uh, tables. It will give different numbers to every table. And if you want to create the bibliography for the table, then you may use the label. For the label, I will just L A B L label, and we use the same label into the tables. Uh, sorry, into the figures. And here I will write tab and um, column tab one. Okay. After that, I if I want to uh, discuss this table anywhere, I will just get uh, uh, the reference tab one. To describe to describe this table everywhere uh, in this LaTeX program. Okay, let's check the results. <coughs> we made little mistake. We have to begin this environment. Okay, and the same I will add this environment. I will add this environment. Okay, let's run it again. <clears throat> let's check the output. Yes, the caption is shown here, and also the table one showed the label, and uh, we will use the label format as we inserted it here to call it uh, in different locations or if you want to insert the list of labels in our documents and if you want to insert line after every row you have to simply use hlan after every row ok let's check it go to the program and we will simply write H line here. I will simply write H line here. Okay, after every row, you have to write it after every row. Okay. Okay, let's check it. Now let's check the results. <coughs> here you can see that the row lines have been inserted here. Okay, I will recommend not to insert this line because um, without these lines, the table look beautiful. Now we will discuss how to insert this table into the whole. We will put simply store here. Uh, we will simply put store here, okay, and same to add it with the table store. We run it once again. Let's check the results. Yes, the table is inserted into the whole page into the one single column. Now, how to adjust it into the uh, how to adjust its width according to the page? We will go to the table, and in the table, we will adjust its width. I will suggest to use this format to 
it just the width here the b and s of the column for example this will be as this will be b and this will be again s and this will be again b okay and uh, this will adjust the table into the whole page and here i will also mention the text width okay Width. Okay, let's run it. Now you can see that this has been inserted here, and uh, uh, we may change it uh, according uh, uh, its width and height. But uh, in this video, we are not going for the. I will upload much about LaTeX and how to work in LaTeX and how to create different papers, different research papers in the LaTeX. Okay, thank you so much for watching.